Hey everybody, welcome back. This is Red Ribbon, and welcome back to an episode of Super Mario RPG, Legend of the Seven Stars. In the last episode, we made it all the way down here to the Temple of Belong from uh, Land's Valley, Land's End. And, uh, as you may guess, yeah, we're going up against Belong once again. But, we have more than just Mallow this time around. That being said, items. I want to keep the B tub ring on on Toadstool, but given that this is going to be another fight with Balom, I think <clears throat> I'm going to take it off of her and give her the true form pin. Just because uh, I don't want to have to deal with that. Down we go. There he is. <sighs> I have to think of another balloon based pun for this and for the title. Hmm? You look tasty. I think I'll just have a snack. Balloon. You know him. You love him. He has a few new tricks this time around. Hopefully, we'll get to see him. He's not too different than before, still the same annoying type of attacks, but he does have a couple new tricks. I never forget a taste. In fact, I can clone someone after just one slurp. Watch! And you all... you all look delicious. But how do you taste? Blech! Sour! There we are. Yep, he can create copies. Ugh. I always hated the enemies that could do that. Just, you know, copy and clone you. Clones aren't. Pff, you all look delicious, but I Went straight back from Mario. Ugh, sour. Dude, you literally just did that. Whatever. Alright. Hold on. Gino's got a new move Gino Blast. Same timing as the other one. Yeah, since he still has some of the same moves as he did before. You all look delicious, but how do you taste? Mmm, tastes peachy. There we are. Yeah, I think he'll keep doing that for every clone there is. And it has roughly the same amount of HP as you do. <laughs> I wonder how these characters feel just watching themselves die. Uh, that's not good in case I need it. You're delicious. How do you taste? Bitter, but not bad. There we are. There, we've seen everybody. Yeah, like I said, he's just not bad. He's just the same as he was before. Just with this weird cloning trick now. I wonder if this is what replaces his scrow attack. You know what? Yeah, pal. You just you do you. Yeah, he'll keep doing this. He, he'll always take a turn to 
clone. I think he can make two clones to make a full party. Not that I'm too concerned. Oh no, not again. I'm starving. Time to go home for dinner. Goodbye, boys and girls. Yeah, as you can see, the clean... As you can see, the clone doesn't go away until you kill it. Flamestone. That's not a move Gino can use. Look at this smug bastard laughing. And this time we don't have to worry about rushing water. Oh, hello again. That pipe is a shortcut to my home. <coughs> that pipe is a shortcut to my home, Monster Town. I'll see you there. Oh. Down I go. Monster Town. What a quaint looking place. Sealed. Look, the shiny stone's reacting. The seal's been broken. Okay. Do not enter that door at this point in the game. Something is terrifying in there, and you will not win that fight. So instead, enter here. So, the super jump is your specialty, right? The multiple jumps of yours are pretty amazing. I heard that, a record, that your record cons consecutive jump stands at 17. How do you do it? Jump more than 30 times in a row and I'll give you a prize. Yeah, I'll see if I can do that. It's really weird. Sometimes I hear the guy next door. He's always mumbling about crystal this and evil that. Isn't a crystal some kind some kind of shiny rock or something? I know you've seen I know I've seen them somewhere. Yeah, so that shiny stone we bought off of that little girl back in Moleville unlocks a super fight. Oh well. Yes, just a minute. I'll be there in a second. <clears throat> oh my! Goombo, what are you doing here? Bowser, it's been ages, hasn't it? Sorry for... Sorry about going AWOL on you. I ran away because I was scared to fight Smithy. A lot has happened since then, and look how far I've come. I'm managing the store now. And look here, here's my little ones. Come on, show your manners and greet the uncles. And greet Uncle Bowser. Hi, Uncle Bowser. Although I can't fight for you, I still have some items if you can use. Maybe you'll find in your heart to forgive me if I can get you equipped? Don't worry. I'm not angry with you. I got new troops now. We're going to reclaim my castle. You go on with your life here. I wish for you the best. Uh, and this is the reason why I love RPG Bowser. We want to help too. Please, please, can we? <laughs> they sell mushrooms, that's cute. I'll buy one. What can I get you? Spike Link. Courage cell. Yeah, he only has stuff for Bowser. Which is fine. Even though I just spent money buying him stuff. Wow. Those work pants are just better in general. <laughs> Whew. Did a good job putting them on him. Oh. That's what that save point is. But I will not be using it. It's in here. Thanks for coming by. Lands in. Okay. Who is it? Sorry, but Sensei isn't in. Oh my gosh! Jagger? Bowser, I haven't seen you for so long. I've been studying here at the dojo under Sensei. Jinx. Because, to tell you the truth, I knew I couldn't beat Smithy. That's why I'm here now. Someday I'm going to return and make you proud. 
don't worry about me. I got new troops now. We're going to take back my castle. So you stick to your guns. Trying there's no tomorrow. My sensei is out right now. We'll be back shortly. In the meantime, will you accept a challenge from me? Um. Sure, why not? Great. You know that I'm not going to go make it easy on me, right? Yeah, this is an optional fight. Jagger is... not super difficult? His master, on the other hand, is something else. So... I'll take on Jagger for now. Well, I need to show off, uh... come back anyway. Yeah, that terror punch is not easy to predict. Up and at him. As far as I know, he's like your typical boss, not weak to much of anything. Hit him with an ultra jump. Give yourself a Geno Boost. It's only going after Geno and Peach. Yikes! You're tough! Yikes! I guess that's to be expected. Mario, you're a top notch fighter. You did well for your inexperience, Jagger. Sensei, have you been here all along? You felt my key, didn't you? Not bad for a novice. <laughs> Your fighting style isn't if isn't as foolproof as you think. I'll accept your challenge any day. Hmm. That can wait. Like I said, he's not diff. Well. <sighs> He's a lot of things. Difficult is one of them. But I noticed there's a key up there. I heard a rumor that isn't that your compass jumper. Okay. I may be out jumped, but you're totally out pumped. I don't know, dude. Those uh, I heard youth ones can kind of go up forever. The strong silent type, eh? Don't you dig these vibes? I wish you would stop doing that. wondering what the heck I'm doing. That key up there has been moving slightly with every time he does that. Ha! The temple key. That'll be useful for later. Hmm. Where am I thinking? Ah, over here, I bet. Yep, right here. Monster Mama. Oh my, a traveler from afar. Welcome to Monster Town, where many of our kind mingle. I'm the landlady, Monster Mama. A star, you say? Oh, you're here to see our star. She's upstairs, so feel free to go and take a look for yourself. She? I never really gave genders to these stars. 
Oh, wait a minute. That's not the star we're looking for. Hmm. Sometimes, if you jump in the right place, treasure boxes will pop out of thin air. Anything like that happen to you? These treasure boxes are known as surprise boxes because they appear out of nowhere. You think you found them all, but there are still 35 left. Is there one right here? Or on top of you? Or over here? Or on top of this mouse guy? Or on your bed? Or anywhere? On top of your star? No? Okay. So what do you think? Isn't our star adorable? She's so talented too. Folks come to see her from afar. Yeah, that's not what we're looking for. Star bees? Oh, star peas. Nope, not familiar with them. So you came all the way out here to search for star bees? It must be really important. This is the last piece on place on land. If you can't find it here, there's only one place left. Is up. <clears throat> totally read that right correctly. Read that, read that line correctly. This is going to be all game. I'm sorry, guys. So, you want to go up there? Ha! You're an open book. Okay, here's what you need to do. There's a secret passage to the sky at Bean Valley. But first you need to scale the cliff beyond the desert to get there. I read that correctly. Since you're such a nice guy, I'll introduce you to, I'll introduce you to someone who can help you. Sky Troopers, I need you! Oh! Sergeant Flutter. What is it? What is our flying time, troops? 8.52 seconds, S Sergeant. Sky Troopers reporting for duty, ma'am. We're 0.52 seconds late. I hold myself personally accountable for the delay, ma'am. <laughs> Still as vivid, rigid as ever about you. <coughs> oh, God, learn to read, asshole. Still as rigid about your as ever about your rules and regulations. No need to bother with the protocol around me. I've got a favor to ask you. Yes, ma'am. Anything we can do for a civilian? Civilian. Damn. This fellow here really wants to get to Speed Valley. Could you help him scale the cliff? Understood, ma'am. The orders are: get mustache over the cliff. We will succeed. We will now deploy ourselves to the cliff at Land's End. Troopers, keep a tight formation. We have liftoff. I like these guys. <laughs> They're odd, but trustworthy. Good luck with your search. And with that, I'm going to call it here. In the next episode, we'll do just that. If you want to see more of my stuff, hit the subscribe button and hit the little bell so you can know when I'm uploading. If you like this video, hit the like button. Next episode, we'll head off to the cliffs in Bean Valley. Alright, see you later.